Hello and welcome to my tutorial on how to create water in Counter-Strike Source's Hammer Editor by Valve. Um, okay, what we do is we have this basic room here. What we're going to do is we're going to grab our brush tool. We're going to make a new brush. And let's just leave it floating so you can get a good idea of what it's going to look like. Um, I've already got my water texture chosen. You can just search for moving. And personally, I think uh, this looks the best. Let's give this one a try real quick and hit enter. That actually looks pretty good. Um, so now let's move that down to the ground. And there we go. Now we have something that looks like water. Um, pretty much that is close to being it. All you have to do now is, I'm going to make it a little bit shorter. All you have to do now is um, create a new entity, and we're going to call it water underscore LOD control. I'll, um, I'll show you guys how to do that since I have my screen captured off. Um, you should look like this, water underscore LOD underscore control. And you don't have to mess with these, they're set good. And you can just uh, close it out. Um, what it does is the further away you get from the water, it starts to look a little bit cheesier, you know, more realistic. Um, when you're closer, it works well. Um, one thing to make sure, make sure you don't have any leaks in your map. So there's a leak, leak between your map and the black. Then it might cause issues with your water, like people might have trouble seeing it. So um, just make sure you don't have any leaks, and make sure that the LOD water water LOD control is not touching the water, and you are good to go. Thank you for watching my basic video tutorial on how to create water in Valve Hammer Editor.